Hey everyone, Joel Anthony here. Today we are outside Dugo's, yes, Dugo's in Dansville, New York, which is in the Rochester, New York area, here to do their burger challenge, guys. But this is not just any burger challenge. This is the biggest burger challenge in New York. Yes, I'm talking like Empire State Building size. This thing's huge, 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 huge. So this is like their double or bigger burger challenge. They have a smaller one here, we're doing the big, big, big one. Um, this is like 15 patties, 15 half pound patties. So we're talking seven and a half pounds of ground beef. We then have bacon, cheese, uh, lots of vegetables on a locally made bakery bun. So it's like a lot of food. It sounds really, really good. We are gonna have 40 minutes to complete the challenge. If not, it is about a $75 price tag. I'm meeting up with uh, my friend David. David is a local food challenger. Like he lives in New York. Um, we've crossed before, we've never done a challenge together, so he's gonna come do this challenge also. Um, but that's about that, guys. So uh, let's head in, let's have fun, let's eat some food. Here in Dansville, they have a lot of history. Um, it is like, they have a castle, um, a lot of old buildings. They used to have like a big train station leading to Western New York here. Um, so yeah, cool stuff. I think this is where Kellogg's, the cereal brand started as well. Um, but anyway, let's go, it's fun. These food is raining, so my camera's getting wet. But uh, let's go eat a giant, giant, the biggest burger, the biggest burger in New York. All right, everybody, so like I said, we might as well get started. I am sitting, sitting, I mean, these burgers are so big. I'm gonna adjust the angle a little bit here, but I'm gonna sit, David is gonna stand, so like you said, um, big burgers, but it looks delicious. I will probably also put it down on its side here in a moment. Um, so let me just maybe adjust that camera, play with this, and we're gonna get eating, because this is very big. Like the Empire State Building. This is the Empire State Building. This is the Twin Towers right here, so. Um, by the way, they, uh, I, I opted for a bit more vegetables on mine than David, but I also want to opt for a little bit less cheese. We made a little bit of a trade over. So. You're going to get started in three, two, one, go. Let's eat. I was going to Thank you. I was going to sit for this, guys, but really, I think I'm going to have to stand. This thing is just, it's so monstrous to have to, like, grab these things. So let's get eating. I'll probably uh, start on the beef. Look like the bird and do a It's a good burger. This is just like hand fresh some fresh beef, never froze them. Salt pepper. I like it. Also have a pile of ketchup behind me. I can do more. Yeah, you I just realized something. I am going to have to adjust something real quick on this. I realize the volume is off on this. One second, guys. Here we go. We got 145. I gotta know. I gotta adjust this volume. There you go, and we have resumed. All right, everyone, so because I messed up, uh, there you go. So now you'll be able to actually hear us better um, in case you couldn't hear us before. So yeah, big burger, fries, all that good stuff. Um, we're well on our way. David is crushing some of the fries. Uh, we are now just like you know two minutes, whatever in. You'll have the timer on screen. So yeah, back to good, back to normal. Let's get a rocket and rolling. Very delicious burger. And like I said, at least you guys can hear us better now. We've been very quiet before, so let's keep going. All right, Joel. Thank you, thank you. Technical difficulties, right? So. Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we're here at Dugo's in Dansville, New York, which is about 45 minutes south of Rochester. Here taking on New York's biggest burger challenge. So these were absolutely giant burgers. I mean, as you can tell, we're talking seven and a half pounds of beef, plus fries, bacon, cheese, just oh, so many items. Um, so for this challenge, um, this is actually like a double or bigger than a double version of their normal challenge. They have a normal challenge, which is like six patties, half pounds of fries, 
Um, a super great size challenge for any beginner, intermediate, anybody wanting to do a burger challenge, definitely come on by Dugo's. Um, and even if you just want a good burger, come on by Dugo's here as well. Um, so people always say, Joel, push yourself, blah, blah, blah. Well, this is essentially doubling the challenge plus some. So yes, definitely pushing myself. Overall, uh, you know, we have at least probably nine pounds of food. Um, being seven and a half pounds of beef itself, not to mention again all the bacon, cheese, the fries, the buns, everything, everything, everything. Um, so food wise, uh, very delicious tasting. You can definitely taste that these are fresh burgers, real burgers, um, which is definitely a big thing for me. The four minutes in. David, how you doing, man? Good. Doing good? The staff and patrons here at Dugo's were awesome as well, and it kind of speaks to their like 60 or 70 year like heritage here. I tell you, it's a lot of meat, but it's very, very good. I really enjoy them. They're known for their burgers here. I can definitely see a lot. Good sized portion too, especially on the challenge. Normally, also really good sized portion. And then Dansville as a town was actually really cool to stop by in as well. The patties have a really nice garlic flavor to them. Definitely. Nicely seasoned. But let's talk a little bit more about the challenge itself. So like we said, um, really good taste in beef patties. Just giant though. This burger was absolutely giant. It was undefeated. Again, they do have the smaller version traditionally. This is basically double plus. Um, and I knew this was gonna be a tough one. I had just come back from vacation. I was not in good eating shape. So we're about seven minutes in. We're both good with all the burgers. David is a man like myself. He likes ketchup. Comment down below if you like ketchup, guys. Ketchup is, and burgers are just so good. He's got to have it. And this thing was just a towering monster. Like we said, the biggest burger challenge in New York. That is like the whole state. Um, but yeah, like I said, it's tasting really good. Uh, here with good friend, Mr. Dave. Um, Dave is a uh, gentleman from New York himself. He does some food challenges. Um, but yeah, so it was cool to kind of meet up with him and uh, you know check out Dansville. And for what better reason than to go to Dugo's? Um, again, pretty much the seasonings in the patties were a good variety of mixture. This kind of their house blend. Um, loved the bacon on there as well. And they're using really, really nice buns, which came from a local bakery. <laughs> All right, we are 10 minutes in. Me and David both get through the burgers. David is going through the fries. He's basically done on the fries. I have not touched mine yet. But the burgers are good. Really like the patty, like the flavors are good. No shortage of burger, that is for sure. But we got about 30 minutes left, so keep on trucking. How are you doing, David? We're good. We're doing good. But that, I believe that's pretty much the majority of the information. I mean, you know, again, it was good taste and food, but giant, giant, giant challenge. So comment down below if you think uh, we're gonna be able to complete this. Give me a hashtag yes or a hashtag no. And ultimately we'll have to tune on in and see if we can beat this burger challenge in only the 40 minute time limit. So with that, let's get eating. Definitely pepper fries. So Joel, after we're done with this, you want to get an ice cream cone? <laughs> Dessert. Dessert is on play. I don't know what to see. I better tell you. Who is there here? We're checking the menu after. The last thing I did with you was ice cream, remember? Wow. <laughs> 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 
I'll tell you, a lot of beef. A lot of meat. We're 14 minutes in. A whole bottle of ketchup is not required for the challenge either, but it's going to be served today. In the house. David is de skewering his meat right there. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. I have to give a shout out to the skewer though. That skewer, that base, I've never had a burger like this, so I didn't have to hold. So, definitely uh, some smart, innovative features oh, there. So, how to get that last ride? Works well. Right underneath. Oh. Nice, uh, juicy bottom button, that's for sure. All right, last patty. Come on, Dave. Come on, you're going to do it. That's a new thing. Comment down below if they should sell growlers of ketchup. <laughs> I mean, you're gonna be using yes, my name. Absolutely. <laughs> growlers of ketchup. I can think of words, you know. <laughs> growlers. You <laughs> will sell them. You're also best growlers. Best growlers of ketchup, guys, coming your way.
Everyone, we are 27 minutes and 22 seconds in. We have a few fries, some buns. Give us a couple patties left. Still doing well. We've got about 12 and a half minutes left, so let's keep on trucking. seconds. I was kind of waiting for the 30-30. I figured might as well do it right on the even dot there. Guys, we got about nine minutes left. Everybody, let's cheer on David. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. David continues to crush that, guys. Very delicious burger. Really <coughs> the food. Um, the staff here and everybody who came out, thank you so much for coming out, everybody. We definitely have a really nice crowd here. <laughs> Western New York represent. Um, but yeah, guys, so Dan's really, really cool spot. I'm going to talk to you more about the, uh, or maybe I already told you more about the history of this place, but really cool. Um, again, the restaurant here has a standing of like 70 years heritage, which is really cool. I think it's awesome that they're keeping the name up. I think it's really awesome. Um, that they're also serving great food with a smile, guys. The staff is super friendly. The food is good, like I said. So let's keep on Ruth and Dave on. And let's get this thing done. Go on, Dave. Go on, Dave. Yeah. 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 do like a tour, two deer champion. Two deer champion. Yeah. I mean, okay, guys. Are you in New York? We're not New York City. So we know I. We got land. We got land. Yeah. You know what? If you do the whole video, are you hunting it? Shooting it? <laughs> So there we go. We got a uh, we got a suggestion to do a hunt, cook, or hunt, cook, clean, and eat. Hunt, clean, or cook, hunt, shoot, yes, clean, yeah. eat. Okay. Um, cook. Dear Joe. Oh, cook as well. So uh, that's an interesting. I mean, maybe we'll make it happen one day. I just don't have the time. Old deer. I just don't have the time. We got our time. You know, I mean, there's only seven minutes left. Seven ten. That's a minute for yeah. Call it. Yeah, I'm gonna call it. I'm not gonna eat six patties in seven minutes. He only has about six patties left though, so he's ate the fast, fast, fast majority of the challenge. Um, just it is, it is a bit tight for uh, for the seven minutes or eight minutes. Yeah, for eight pounds and, you know, 40 minutes. It's a lot. It's a lot of food. What about everybody? Thank you so much for watching. Dave, any words? Um, the time was 30-30. What do you want to do after this, wink wink? I don't know, like, yeah, make a wish? I don't know. <laughs> Alright everybody, so, um, yeah, so
So overall, guys, like you said, really, really good challenge. Really enjoyed it. Definitely, definitely a big one. Uh, thank you to Dave for coming and joining me today. Thanks for coming to the challenge, my friend. Uh, definitely lots of meat sweats in the future, I'll say. But uh, yeah, guys, like I said, crazy big challenge. The biggest burger in New York that I know of, for sure. Um, so if you ever want a big burger, a delicious burger, a little burger, definitely come to Dugos here, guys. Again, in Dansville, New York. Really cool spot. Didn't know there was so many history. There's so much history here. They have a castle. They have uh, also lots of garbage plates. Garbage plates, dumpster plates, which is a Rochester thing. Again, we're only about like 40 minutes south of Rochester, so really cool area to check out. Would definitely recommend it. Uh, but that, uh, we're in, well, I'm gonna get the meal for free. Damn, we're it's only, it's only 75 bucks, but I will say that's a really good deal. I think for the uh, yeah, you gotta you gotta get your money's worth. You gotta get your money's worth. Uh, I'm not sure if you get a t-shirt or anything, but we'll find that in uh, But that, guys, thank you for watching. We're the first person to do the big challenge. And, of course, the next time, stay happy, I'll be hungry, happy eating. And I can come around here, so let's say, have a lovely day. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much, you rock.